It's unthinkable, but what if something like what happened in Colorado today happened here? SNN local news reporter Grant Boxleitner posed that very question to local law enforcement, and he can tell us more about what he found. Well, that's right, Lena. The area men and women in law enforcement say preparing for the worst is a mindset that guides their training to take out a shooter. We're acutely aware of what could potentially happen at any time. We're taught that way. Sarasota County Sheriff SWAT team members are training to take down an active shooter. The same scenario that horrified those at an Aurora, Colorado movie theater when a gunman opened fire, killing at least 12 people and injuring more than 50. Every time something like this occurs, we re reassess our training to see how best we can attack this particular problem. The Sarasota County Sheriff's Office has been conducting active shooter training since 1999, and it's not just limited to SWAT team members. Every deputy goes through this training. Sheriff's Captain Mike Pelfrey says it was the Columbine shootings 13 years earlier, just 15 miles from the movie theater massacre, that forever changed the tactical response for a mass shooting. No longer do patrol squads just surround the building and wait for SWAT. We have different tactics. Uh, when we get there, it may be a single officer, it may be a couple of officers, and to coin a term, we charge to the sound of the gunfire. And when the gun fires on, we know where the active shooter is. So we go there. Meanwhile, moviegoers at the AMC Theater at Westfield Sarasota Square say this tragedy is weighing on their minds. You have to search, search people going to the movie now for guns, just like they do on airplanes. You got to walk through, you have to th walk through security probably. So we've been watching the news all morning, and I, so as we were entering the parking lot, I was very cautious to look around. It's just you're a parent, so it's just inherent. You have to you know, look around to see if everything's safe, because I have two little boys. And Lena, Sarasota police also have a SWAT team that undergoes similar type of training like we just saw, and the Northport police also have four members assigned to the Sarasota County Sheriff's Office. They don't have their own SWAT team, but they get some of this training as well. And it's the kind of question you don't ever think you have to ask. What about if it happens no, in the movie theater? No, you don't. And being in the movie theaters today, a lot of people were a little bit nervous when we were talking to them. So. Okay, understandably. Thank you very much, Grant.